Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. I'm coming to you. I'm doing some collective readings today. I'm about to go out. So I'm gonna, I'm just trying to knock these out real quick before I leave. We're gonna draw for five of these. These are hard to shuffle, so I've got them in my little, my big little ganja bag here to draw for. Please like, share and subscribe to the video. It is greatly appreciated for the growth of my channel. This could resonate with you any sign you are. So don't get too caught up on the signs. Just put yourself where you see fit. This could be pertaining to yourself or somebody else in your environment here. So don't get too caught up in all of that. Gender roles could be reversed also. So it could be that you, it pertains to you or somebody around you. You could be feminine, masculine, flip it, switch it, take it how it resonates. Everybody embodies both energies, both feminine energy and masculine energies at different times here. So just keep that in mind. Hand, in need of help, assistance and guidance here. So you could be, somebody could be reaching out to you for some sort of assistance with something here. Or you could need help from somebody. Stalk, news of a birth or a new business opportunity here. You could be getting news of a pregnancy here. Or you could have some sort of new business opportunity that could be coming towards you here. Bird perched, waiting for news, a package or a letter. There's definitely some sort of news. Somebody's going to reach out to you soon about something. This could be a family member for some of you here. I just got that bird perched, waiting for news in the previous reading here. But it was it was not positive news in that one. Ear, good news. You've got good news. I feel like this is going to be good news, whatever this is here. This definitely could be some sort of new endeavour that you are going to be approached with. Cobweb, protected from negative forces beyond your control here. So you've got a lot of protection around you here at this time, which is always reassuring to know. And whatever this news is, it's also protected. If this is something that you are going to be guessing it, getting into, presented to you, an opportunity. I feel like somebody wants to give you something with that hand card there. Messages for the collective here messages for the collective i'm getting air energy with that bird those birds uh, gemini libra aquarius you could hear something this could be that it's specifically going to be a phone call messages for the collective messages for the collective patience this could be something that you've waited on i accept that everything happens in divine order and health, I will honour the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. You could be waiting to get some sort, I don't know why I'm getting this, but you could have. You could be working in the gym or doing something aesthetically here that you're waiting for results for. You could be partaking in a diet or you could be um, doing something here. Sorry about that, guys. I had to leave for just a second. Okay, you definitely could be waiting for some sort of results aesthetically here. You could be working out in the gym. Just make sure you're not overdoing it, overtiring yourself in some way, shape or form here. Messages for the collective. But you're being called to be patient or you've had to be patient for this news that is coming towards you here. Or this is something that you're going to need to be patient with here. Messages for the collective. Okay, we've got Ace of Wands. Definitely something new coming in. This could be a new business opportunity. Something that's going to spark your passion here. Okay, Nine of Swords is in the reverse. We've got the Magician in the reverse. Six of Pentacles in the reverse here. You are really, Page of Swords, you're really taking care of where you're giving your energy, your time, your resources at this time here. And I feel like you've got a lot of eyes on you at this moment in time because you're doing this here. You see how that page of swords is over looking at that six of pentacles in the reverse. You could have specifically withdrawn from giving to somebody specific or it could be that you're just being more mindful over where you're giving your energy and what you're giving your time to here. With the four of cups, you're definitely... You know, you may be coming across as if you're not interested or you don't really care very much or, you know, you're, you're just not looking at anything else other than what you've got in front of you type of energy here. And people can see this. I feel like you're giving off a vibe that you're very focused on something here. This could be that you've started a new job with the Ace of Wands here 
and people are watching this happen here. Nine of Swords, this could have been something that has been quite stressful. Again, make sure you're not tiring yourself overthinking here with the Nine of Swords in the reverse. With the Magician in the reverse, this could be somebody else here. There could have been some trickery in the past here. Because I'm getting good news from the top, the, the Oracle cards, the tea leaves. But I feel like somebody could want to come and throw a spanner in your works here with that magician card and the hanged one in the reverse. Bring some sort of stagnancy towards you here. But we're going to see what that is. I don't feel like that's your energy collective. You could be an air sign. There's a lot of air energy here. You could be a Sagittarius and Aries here or an earth sign. But don't get too caught up on the sign Pisces as well. I feel like you're not even bothered, like whoever this is that might be coming towards you to throw some sort of spanner in the works or wants to slow you down with that hanged one, I just feel like you're not even paying attention, <laughs> you're not even paying attention to this person. We're going to clarify, I'm going to draw for a new deck to clarify, okay let's see what this is, Ace of Wands, what is this new opportunity? You're being very strategic, yeah. You're 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 moving in silence right now. You're being very strategic. Yeah, 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 yeah. I love when the cards do this. Okay, so we've got the seven of swords. The seven of swords is not only trickery, the seven of swords is also being strategic, having some sort of master plan. You've got a plan in order to move towards some success, and you're gonna be very, very successful here. You're holding back, or you're being asked to hold back and be very strategic over who you're telling your business to at this time, who you're letting know what. You know, people are watching you with that page of swords and they see you working on something behind the scenes and you're being asked to keep things to yourself, hold back, you know, need to know basis type of energy because you are taking some sort of leap of faith. You've got something new that you are going to be working towards and it's going to be very, very successful for you, whoever I'm speaking to here with that six of wands, the full card, the moon. Yeah, you're being asked to keep it in Keep it to yourself with that moon card, what you are working on. Yeah, do not let people know at this time what your next move is going to be here. With that magician energy, I would be very, very careful. Keep things to yourself, you know, need to know basis. Do not let people know what you're taking leaps towards, what you're working towards here, because people could sabotage that. Only allow people to know what they need to know when it's time for them to know it, when things have manifested or when you're already doing it or when, you know, you've signed on the dotted line or you've sealed the deal in some way, shape or form. There's a need to do that. I'm getting that. Six of Pentacles. You're no longer giving to... Yeah, this could be that you're no longer giving into a relationship here or some sort of home situation and somebody's watching you. That Page of Swords. You've got eyes on you. Page of Swords. Yeah, and they don't like what they're seeing here. They feel stuck in some sort of overthinking here. You know, this could have been that you've withdrawn or you're no longer giving to a home situation, a family situation maybe. And whoever this is, they're watching you. This could be an air sign specifically here. More on the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, you're no longer nurturing something. Yeah, you're no longer being treated unfairly in a situation here. You're moving yourself forward. You've withdrawn something here. With the page of pentacles here in the reverse you could be dealing with a libra here or an air sign or an earth sign that queen of pentacles is very nurturing okay so just as what i've said you're, you've taken your energy out of something you it could be that you're no longer nurturing a relationship here you've withdrawn your energy here there's been an ending here. This could have been something that caused a lot of heartbreak or somebody is heartbroken over you here. But with the justice card in the reverse, it's almost like other people may feel or somebody may feel like this is harsh or you're judging the situation harshly or this is not a good judgment in their eyes for you to be making here. But you were being treated unfairly with that justice card in the reverse. You could have gone through something where somebody put you through a lot of pain, a lot of turmoil with the Three of Swords here, and you've withdrawn your energy with the Queen of Pentacles here. The Queen of Pentacles nurtures things. So with the combination of cards that is here, you are no longer nurturing whatever this is here. Yeah, Ace of Wands, Empress. Yeah, yeah. This is somebody, whoever's watching you here, this is somebody who feels unfinished business with you if I'm honest with you with the world card in the reverse it's almost like they feel like 
you're no longer passionate about them. You're no longer wanting to have a rebirth. You're no longer wanting to, you know, bring some new energy and, you know, grow anything with them with both of those cards in the reverse here. And they're watching you. Who is this person? The devil in the reverse. You, Yeah, this is so. Yeah, you're rejecting this. Four of Cups. You do, you're not really even looking at this. You're not looking at this. This, this it could have been somebody who you had a home with here or a family member specifically. This could be a family situation. But you're no longer looking at this here. You've got your back turned here. You're looking at your cups that you have in front of you. Not whatever this is. And this could have been a very toxic situation for you here. But something was revealed. With that devil card in the reverse, we see something for what it is. Something could have been revealed to you here. You could have found out something about an individual here. You could have found out that somebody was being sneaky. Sneaky with their sexual energy possibly here. With the Ace of Wands and the Seven of Swords. Manipulative energy. Let's take a look at that magician in the reverse. Move in silence, guys. Yeah. Yeah. They see you're in your bag. Oh, my goodness. Temperance. I can't make it up. You could be an earth sign. I cannot make this up, guys. Look. Look at this energy. We've got the temperance. You could be a Sagittarius here. You've got a lot of balance coming towards you. And you've got a lot of abundance. Whoever you are, you're in your bag. You see that king of pentacles here. You're working on something big. You're working on balance here. You're working on bringing some sort of equilibrium to your life. With your finances. With your energy. With your stability here. And you're moving towards this with haste. Chariot. Fast moving. Fast. 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 I love this energy for you here. Moving tenaciously here with that chariot card and that knight of swords here. But you're grounded with that king of pentacles here. You're not shooting aimlessly here. You're moving with logic, with that seven of swords, strategic. You know where you are going and you're not going to allow manipulation or, or, or anything to come in the way here. King of Swords energy. Logical thinking here to bring balance to yourself, your situation, your life, your money, whatever it is for yourself here. Who is this manipulation coming from? Knight of Wands in the reverse. Somebody in and out. Somebody not serious. Yeah, somebody from your past possibly that you found out some sort of secrets about. Here. This could be anybody. This could be a friend with that six of cups. This could be somebody that you've known from childhood. This could have been a relationship, some sort of past life connection that you have with an individual. Any more here? Any more? Magician in the reverse again. Yeah, you, you, you're not even bothering to look at this person. You're not even. You're not even. It came out. Magician came out twice in the reverse. Whatever this person is... Is, is planning to do or wanting to come whatever energy that, that they're throwing at you here it's not even touching you because you're con concentrating on your bag you're concentrating on yourself you're concentrating on what you've got on your table here making the table setting the table for yourself and you're looking good doing it with that king of pentacles i love to see it i don't even think you need advice here yeah Whew. wow what a reading i'm gonna draw for one of these to finish Messages for the collective. Messages for the collective. Yeah. Messages for the collective. Career. I can't make it up. Animals, you could be could have got a new pet recently here. Not every message will resonate for everybody, but or there could be a need to, you know, get in touch with nature again. That could be something grounding. I'm getting grounding energy with that. But career. You're birthing something new here. You're standing in your power and you're looking good doing it. I love this for you. Compassion, forgiveness. And whoever this is, you just got to keep it moving. Have compassion. You know, forgive whoever this is and just pray that they come out of this non low vibrational toxic energy here and go wherever they're going, you know. Collective, I love that for you. I claim that reading. Wow. If you like how I read, please like, share and subscribe to the video. It is greatly appreciated. But until next time, I will see you soon. I'm about to fly out, do some things with my kids. But until next time, I will see you soon. Mwah. Bye.